This is how we measure partition compliance of the respiratory system, chest wall, and lung. We need airway pressure, esophageal pressure, flow, and volume. During an inspiratory hold, we measure the difference in airway pressure between PEEP and plateau pressure. This is the total pressure generated by the respiratory system, 10 cm of water in this case. On the esophageal pressure, we measure the pressure swing at the same time point which is the pressure generated by the elastic recoil of the chest wall, 3 cm of water in this case. The difference between the total pressure generated by the respiratory system and the pressure generated by the chest wall is the pressure generated by the lung, 7 cm of water in this case, which is the difference in transpulmonary pressure induced by tidal inflation. By knowing the tidal volume, 600 ml in this case, we can then measure the compliance of the entire respiratory system, of the chest wall and of the lung, by dividing the tidal volume for the respecting swings in pressure.